What's up YouTube, it's Jeffrey again. Today we're doing uh, a very first custom, but like reversible custom. Like, And because it's October and it's we're getting close to Halloween, I decided to make Thomas from Shed 17. So how'd I do this guy? I simply just grabbed a Trackmaster Thomas that came with the uh, Great Discovery, like you know, canyon drop set. Then I just simply just took off, I, I just plopped off this part. I bought some skeletons from uh, the Dollar Tree. Grabbed some uh, blue tack, you know, like this, this blue tack stuff that, you know, it's like blue tack putty. And then I just simply stuck it onto the skeleton skull and on the inside of the face. And now how I, I make them do the, the expressions, these are just placeholders that I made out of paper. I might print out some more realer ones, like as seen in Shed 17 itself, like so I'll probably do that. But for now it's just a placeholder face. So of course it's a double side face, and I'll just, yeah it's a bit hard to, yeah there we go. You can. Like he's in his shock form to discover that he's like about to rip off his face. Like that. Yeah, so he's got a double side face made of paper. I'll just, uh. Yeah, there we go. Now, and with even colors, you can, uh. Um. Some steady force. You could take off the face. And now we got Thomas without the face, so yeah, that's a pretty cool thing. The only things you're gonna need to make this, like, you know, potato head like custom, is like a Trackmaster classic Thomas. I recommend the Great Discovery one. A plastic skeleton from, I don't know, a dollar store which is just a dollar and some uh, blue tack so yeah that's basically how you make a shed 17 Thomas in trackmaster form so yeah hope you enjoyed this short little custom review video and also happy October and remember have a safe and happy Halloween <laughs>